Hi there, my name is Samuel and welcome back to another video and today we shall be taking a look at the new Batman sets that have just been revealed, well technically earlier today, this afternoon, and the cow was revealed a few days ago, which originally I was going to wait for HD images, which starting off with the Batman account, which is a pretty funny name because I don't know, I keep wanting to say Batman's account, not Batman cow, I get, well yeah, he's Batman, so it should be in a pl plural S. Anyway, 410 pieces, 55 pounds, 6 dollars and 60 euros, and this set honestly it looks pretty awesome, I have to, I really like the shaping i think it's great though the chin strap does look a bit dodgy i hope it is a lot better in person and then you can see that that cockpit piece i believe is what they're using i think that is one from the 2012 of quinjet it does appear to be and that i think looks pretty cool though i think white or yellow would have been better but then the white would have sort of like bended in with the eyes which exactly wouldn't, wouldn't have been helpful and i've talked about to someone about this and then they sort of pointed out the eyes which i don't see an issue i get that like that some people won't get why they're white but it sort of works because like lego like thing that they've always done but yeah you can sort of see some anti studs at the top but that is fine but genuinely i think this is a pretty cool one the logo is pretty cool there's no name on the box but that is just an interesting fact there and yeah i think this is a really good set and i can't wait to add it to the collection though i do recommend if you had it don't put it next to venom and darth vader because then you would never be able to like tell the difference between them or ben's one that could be a really cool video one day anyway let's move on to the next set which apologies for the audio on the last clip i was doing it over my desk and for some reason it came out really echoey which is really annoying so my apologies there anyway since so 6188 Batman Classic TV Series Batmanville. We do not know how many pieces. This is said to be $40, 40 euros, and £35. And this will have two many figures being Batman and Joker from the time period in the classic batman i cannot really remember the date of it but yeah this set honestly looks really awesome i have to admit though it is a shame this is practically the same as the other one i will maybe i could do a comparison eventually when i get a hold of this one but yeah this is pretty cool and they give you a fact as you see on the final photo here you can actually remove the stud shooters which is pretty cool and replace it which i think this is based on that free because it has the base and the black and the fact that you can do that and that was the biggest complaint about that so maybe i want to know did they add that in for extra i think they potentially did but yeah that Honestly, I think it was pretty cool. You get Joker, you get Batman. I believe Batman's slightly different. Joker's got different expressions. Not sure about the body print. Well, no, I guess we'll do a comparison at some point. And it's a shame that for that money, you get two minifigures. Could they have not given us someone else? Like another villain? I don't know if there was another villain. But, like, at least Robin or, like, a Dick Grayson or just something like that. So, yeah, that is pretty interesting, I have to admit. Now, let's move on to the final set, which is a four-plus set. Which, taking a look at set 7618, oh, Batman versus the Joker, Batman Bill Chase. We've known about its name for quite a well, originally thought, we thought this would be a 1960s a 4 plus set, which I know Batgirl isn't a villain, but I did realise I was looking through the posters for that as I made it and as I go along. And then I was like, hey, we haven't had a character. But anyway, this set is pretty interesting. And this will apparently be £25. No, this will mostly be 28 because they have gone up. $30, 30 euros and 136 pieces. And honestly, this set doesn't look too bad. But like, it's not the best. The Batman built looks way better than any other 4 plus Batman build. We've had the skateboard is alright. The bank thing is a bit different. I guess in the lasers and Joker's thing looks pretty awesome pretty unique until you look at the back it looks so square but yeah there's not much else to say I won't review this set I will get it eventually and most probably at the end of its like lifespan of the shelf run but yeah it looks an okay set don't get me wrong I like Joker's rocket launcher that I've just seen so yeah I think that is a pretty okay set I mean Batman's got those little things on the side and the dish looks pretty cool and there we have it that is all of the Batman sets that have been revealed I think I have done it sort of in my order from favourite to least favourite I like the can then it is the Batman 1960 I have the other one. Not much of a change, mainly the front is really that's done and the windows aren't on a hinge position. And then this set is, eh, like, honestly, we could do without. I wouldn't really miss anything. Really, it seems like Bat Marvel has gone really good this year and Batman's kind of gone down. I'm not going to lie, it definitely has. Lately, I don't get why, but so many other characters. We've got, like, Shazam, we've got Snyder Cut. Like, there's so many things that Lego could do and I'm hoping we do. I'm hoping that they sort of do. Maybe, like, if they did, like, a Snyder Wave or something like we've got the Infinity Wave, like, Honestly, I think Batman needs to be retired for now. We could get Superman. They're like, as I say, the CW. I could, I want to do a video on this so bad. Like, well, there are so many things we could get: Supergirl, Flash, Arrow, Legends of Tomorrow, Black Lightning's another one, and um, Batwoman. All of these probably are, oh, but then that bat. Like, at least give us Arrowverse. Like, please, we need more Flash sets, more Superman, more Supergirl, more Wonder Woman. Like, all these other heroes. We've got Plastic Man. We've only seen him once. And then there's also many others. We've got like Suicide Squad. 
Squad. There are so many areas that they can do, and all they're doing at the minute is Batman. Like, honestly, why are they doing so many? You don't need this many. Like, who doesn't want a 200 pounds UCS Star Labs? Like, that would be incredible expensive, but that would be incredible. And really, I'm, I'm going to end up writing about it with Moat, please. I will save that for. I'm going to have to do a video at some point. I really, really need to do a video on it. I just reminded myself. So, thank you all for watching this video. What do you think of this wave? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you think it's a bit luckluster? Anyway, leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. And until tomorrow, video. see you there. Bye for now.